Now, okay, I know everything is blank. I, I, I really, really do. Ah, I don't, I, I don't know that I can wait. I, I'm going to be honest with you guys. Ooh, boy. I, first of all, I, first of all, I want you guys to know how much it is taking all of my willpower to not just go to the summon screen right this freaking instant. You do not know how much it's taking out of me to not just do it. But I promised certain content. To be fair, I didn't think it was going to take as long as it did. Uh, if you guys were watching the collab between me, Nyx, and uh, Bite Size, Pigeon Peanut, uh, Z Zora Sora. Damn, I'm bad with names. Uh, Nullsify. We were all... Honestly, it was a lot of fun. I wish I, I wish I had talked a little bit more with everybody because they all seem like genuinely chill people, but I'm always so nervous with like talking to people. I am antisocial and shy. And somehow that combination made me into a streamer. I don't really understand how that happened, but it did. My point being though, is that I got a couple of things I wanna do while I'm getting everything set up for the live stream. I have sent out the notifications to everyone that we are now rolling for Firefly, but I got two videos that I wanna do and we're gonna do them as one solid video. It is the reaction to uh, it is the reaction to Firefly's trailer. I haven't seen this yet, and I'm really glad that uh, Nix's chat did not spoil this for me. Um, we mentioned the character trailers a lot during the during the discussion, and I'm just glad that they didn't mention anything specific. So I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna jump into this, and hopefully, you know, everyone kind of shows up while I'm while I'm doing everything. So let's go ahead. Let's jump in. Let's get started. After, after I shut off the music. Silly Fox, that would be dumb. How could you not shut off the music? Okay, there we go. Reinforcements. I repeat, requesting reinforcements. Ooh. Okay, okay. Ooh, ooh, what are those wet? Wait, is that the IPC? Wait, what? What is this? This looks like Pentacony. Oh. Oh God, what is all this? Yo! I'm so- Fortunately, I was also born a weapon to be destroyed. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god, what is this? What is... Also, what is the wolf thing? Yo, go Firefly! You show him what you're made of! This music is so epic, by the way. Oh my god. I can't. I can't right now. What is this? Okay, I'm sorry. I... I, I... Oh. Gumas, Iron Cavalry. Oh. Celeron, Hunter. Then who will you be in the future? I. Oh. To burn to ashes is the honor of Gumas Iron Cavalry. Like destiny, it cannot be defied. <laughs> Yo, this is taking up. Yo, what is this Sailor Moon shit that's going on right now? What is this? Oh my gosh. I'm sorry, people were saying it, they were disappointed in this? Yo, this looks like a scene out of a mech anime. This is straight out of Gundam or shit. In the future, I will be oh my God. Until I die. It's 
to us. Oh my gosh! Holy shiitake mushrooms. Oh, and now there's a date with Kalis. Oh, oh, you're hitting me in the feels. You are hitting me into the feels. It's so not nice. What the hell was this trailer? What the absolute hell was this trailer? I can not stand it. It was so good. Are you seriously telling me people were like, uh, no, this was bad. No, this was so freaking awesome. Now, I do have a couple of questions as I go back into this. Um, I got, let me, let me go back real quick. Uh, let's see. First of all, what was Firefly's beef with the IPC going on here? Like... <laughs> This looks like Pentacony, but everyone who's just laying on the ground looks like, look like IPC goons. And I'm just curious, what reason is there for, I mean, to be fair, I guess the IPC does have bounties on everything. D like on all the Stellaron hunters, so it's not a surprise that they would fight. I just know that someone that we're gonna get the comment of uh murder happy cheerful girl and it's like it's interesting because it feels like yes Firefly is very much murder happy but it feels like she's not really doing this of her own accord you know what I mean like it, it's not so much a split personality because that's not what it feels like it's more like it's more like she does this because she has to kind of thing. Like, and I know that there are some people who will say, it's like, oh, well, this just makes terrible writing. Because here's the thing. It's pretty obvious. Firefly, she definitely cares that she's doing this. The scene where we see Sam holding her by her neck. I would say this scene, 100% is like a battling of your inner demons kind of thing. Where, where it's the Iron Cavalry is almost its own persona within herself. If Star is lurking, uh, no, that is not a persona reference. Like, almost like they're, they are considered different aspects. You have Firefly, who wants nothing more than to be an ordinary girl and choose her own life. But then you have Sam, who is very much the embodiment of the Iron Cavalry. Stretching, stretching themselves so thin until they just combust into ash. Yeah, exactly. It, this is more like Hulk and the Hulk and Bruce Banner kind of thing, which is so fascinating. Now, to be fair, the thing that is pretty obvious is that Firefly has quite a lot of control. Like, it, she's not actually out of control, so that does kind of take some, uh, some of that aspect away. I don't know. It's like, that's what this scene seems to tell, and the form where she like gets the uh the flames it, it's like how do i put this uh you know it it that gallant mon form the one where it's like you know the the flaming cape and the swords that one is where it kind of feels like she's in the most control like that that shows us but maybe that's the only time where she really is in control when she pushes herself to the absolute limit of course, some some can say I'm just trying to find excuses, but it's like, this is very interesting. Because it's pretty obvious that despite serving the Stellaron Hunters, who submit themselves to the idea of fate, Firefly wishes to defy that fate as much as possible to make her own decisions and choices. Basically speaking, it is very interesting, but I just love this Sailor Moon-esque little transformation scene. It is so cool. I love this. This is so damn amazing. Oh man, I want to use that as, hold on, let, let, me, let me get that back. Holy shit, that's my thumbnail. That is going to be the thumbnail for this video. 
my god this the entire animation of this this thing used up like i, I don't even know would you guys say this is about equal to a Venturine's animation budget? <laughs> because I feel it. They 100% are putting everything into Firefly that they possibly can. Yeah, no, you're right, Red. This is nowhere near a Venturine's bu animation budget. <laughs> like, I, I would say out of all of the characters, the characters they definitely have put the most effort into promotional work for which is very ironic because I'm sure people would say Acheron, and they did. I do feel like Aventurine, Robin, and now Firefly are like the top three promoted characters right now. Acheron was cool. I loved her stuff, but legit, I do feel like they are putting so much more effort into all of this. Ac Although I will say Acheron's uh, Myriad Celestia trailer was probably the best out of all of them. I don't know. I, I think that the very interesting Japanese-esque art style really blent well, really blended well with the storytelling. So I do think it was probably one of the better Myriad Celestias. But then there's just all of this. Oh my God. Look at this. This is straight out of an anime. Hoyoverse, please. I need, I need. A Star Rail anime. I'm begging you right now. I specifically need this scene on my television. My God, I love this. I also love the personal. I will always love the personalized Star Rail symbol. Yeah, she dual wields. She's got two swords. Have you not seen her attack animations yet, Red? My god! Yeah, she dual wields! It's awesome! Well, I now know that Red did not watch, uh, the tr did not watch the Pen the Farewell Pentacony live stream. Because it was in there! You could see it! They- they displayed her animations and everything! Red is usually the one I have- You're trying not to roll for? Too freaking bad. Get in there. Not, nah, uh, you know what? If you don't want to roll for it, that's fine. Uh, that just means more for me. Okay, 100%. That trailer was awesome. But now, now we have the uh, Firefly Pulse song. This is a duet with both the Firefly and Sam English VAs. And I am... I am so excited for this because both of them are awesome. I, I, lo I have loved their interactions in uh, previous live streams that I've seen. And so far, they seem like really chill, pe really chill people. So let's do it. Let's see what we got, guys. I I'm <clears throat> Ooh. Would not believe your eyes. Oh, hold up. Eyes. Hold up. Is this Fireflies by Owl City? Oh no, you free! <laughs> oh God! Yes! This is amazing! Oh, this is so good! I also love that Aiden is 100% trying to maintain the Sam voice. Oh my god. Yo! Oh my god, this is beautiful. Yo, this adaptation is amazing. Oh, no. Oh, man. That, oh, God. That better give me, like, all of the luck. I kind of just want to make this one whole video 
but I feel like if I don't split it into two, it's just going to be a thing. Look, Red, I'm trying not to open it because I'm currently on my main screen and I don't want to open it in just in case it's something that I shouldn't open on screen. So give me a second. Okay. But before I take a look at that image, if you guys stayed for the end of that portion of the stream, thank you. If you are watching this on YouTube, also thank you. But uh, no, you should absolutely come and join us over at twitch.tv slash fgrolls where you can check out my live reactions and also watch me roll for characters and suffer live. It's a, it's a thing. And also, guess what? One of our mods is currently on the chopping block. Because if I get Clara while rolling for Firefly, mod privileges revoked. In any case, thank you guys for being here, and I will catch you guys in the next one. For those of you guys who are still in stream, we're about to we are about to die. <laughs>